Dubai Reuters A ship carrying 5,500 tons of flour docked in Yemen's Hodi to port in the Red Sea on Sunday, the first after more than two weeks of a blockade by a state-isled coalition fighting the Houthi movement, local officials said. Saudi Arabia and its allies closed air, land and sea access to the Arabian Peninsula country on November 6 to stop what it calls a flow of arms to the Houthis from Iran. The action came after Saudi Arabia intercepted a missile fired towards its capital Riyadh. Iran has denied supplying the Houthis with weapons. The delivery is the first aid to arrive through Houthi to port, controlled by the Houthis, after the coalition allowed a flight carrying humanitarian aid workers to the Yemeni capital of Sana'a on Saturday. Workers unload aid shipment from a plane at the Sana'a airport, Yemen November 25, 2017. Reuters Stringjith ship is 106 meters long and carries 5,500 tons of flour, one of the Yemeni officials said. Aid agencies said the blockade had worsened the humanitarian crisis in Yemen where the war has left an estimated 7 million people facing famine and killed more than 10,000 people. The coalition gave clearance for UN flights in and out of Sana'a from Amman on Saturday, involving the regular rotation of aid workers. After reopening Sana'a airport, UNICEF has also sent vaccines there. The charity Save the Children said an estimated 20,000 Yemeni children under the age of five were joining the ranks of the severely malnourished every month, an average of 27 children every hour. Writing by Aziz El Yaqabi, writing by Elaine Hardcastle, Greg Malajar, Standards, The Thomson Reuters Trust, Principles.